Hey y'all, so I have a package from Marissa uh, Walker. Um, I had ordered um, the junk journal she had recently made using um, uh, Hey Pumpkin from Cray Paper. And she surprised me with some extra goodies and her um, she made an entry for my giveaway. So I want to share everything here with you. Um, so I'm super excited. So let me show the journal first. Um, I have her little, look how cute, everything coordinates, um, and look how cute this little witch feet bag <laughs> is that she stuck the little journal fits perfectly in here, um, and I'm gonna put some pictures and write in here, um, so I'm excited, I'm hoping to go, um, um, I'm hoping to go pumpkin picking this year, um, and maybe do a couple haunted attractions, so some little pictures and things, um, will be fun and um, I plan to go to a, a few harvest festivals um, so I plan on taking pictures and things and um, so I'm going to write and um, put pictures in here so I absolutely fell in love with this journal I told her I wanted to buy it even before I saw the inside and she was like wait 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 let me show you the inside because you might not like the inside and I'm like I don't care I want it um, and she used the cover of the um the paper pad to make this like she used all her scraps up in this and I love all her rough stitching with like all the I just love it so um it says fright night and it has the little witchy on the front spooky as Halloween and the lace I love how she layers um she does amazing work um and she used up all her scraps so she has this cute little corner pocket with this oh sorry I'm not even in frame with this cute tag let me come down here and yeah okay so she has the little um ephemera piece um the cards that say scary and she did some stitching and it says mwahaha with the little um witchy poo and then she has just some papers layered here underneath really cute and she did some stamping um so like i can put a picture under there and then journal on the back um and then there's this um i think she said it's either tea dyed or coffee dyed paper in here um, and um, this glossy bag and this witch, uh, this witch, this ghost I love. I'm actually this witch. For, uh, no, I keep saying this witch. This ghost from this collection. I'm actually planning on getting this this little ghosty girl here. I'm actually planning on getting her tattooed. So that's how much I love this collection and how much I love ghosts. And this one is just so cute. Um, I want to get her tattooed. So um, she'll be going on my you know my my sleeves because my sleeves are like Halloween horror kind of thing um, my next one I'm getting Edgar Allan Poe right here I'm getting um like a really pretty ornate frame actually he's going more over here than here um, I'll put something else here but it's gonna be an ornate frame with him inside it and a raven sitting on the top of the frame so super excited so anyways look how cute this little tag is more stitching love it this is from the collection i believe um and then it says eek so i can put a picture here it says spooky because you want to try um i have to be careful in this because where things are coffee and tea dyed it's acidic so you have to be careful where you put pictures because it can actually change the color of them so you have to um uh be careful um i don't know if this is coffee dyed or tea dyed i think it is but um there's kind of this blocking it so it's kind of okay so um then there's a black doily in here look how cute so i can put a little picture here too like a little um i cut it out in a, like a half circle picture and then i can journal here if i want um and then i can also um i can leave this or what i can do is i can just put some like white paint whitewash it and then i can journal over that um and she has fabric here and then she has a little stitched pocket here. Again, using up all her scraps. She layered um, keep, keep Calm and Eat Candy. I haven't, I'm so excited to start playing with this collection. I have some really cute ideas. And then again, here's all her paper scraps. <laughs> See her scraps? I love it. And the cat peeking out. <laughs> and this is Boo. So she added little Boo there. Just love it. Look at her. It's just fun. Um, um, and then there's this um, dyed guest check. She did some stamping. Oops. She did some stamping. This is Boo Eek. Trick or treat. I can do some journaling here. 
Um, put a picture here. She has some lace over the, where the white is. And then the crow. And it says eek. I love this candy corn paper. I love it. And then this is a little fabric pocket. And again, beware. And there's um, skull, her scraps, spooky. There's a little spider. Um, lots of fun. Um, I can put a picture here. I can put a picture here. I can put a picture on the back. Whatever I want to do. Um, and then here it says boo. Um, and this could be a little tuck spot. Um, um, I can put a picture under here. And like this is like a little tibbin. And just like flip it up. Um, uh, or I can just have it as a page. And she has some like scallop punching on the side. Um, I can definitely put a picture here. Um, uh, or I can just write. Um, it says trick or treat. I like that I can do some writing on here. Um, and then again, if I want, I can do the whitewash and do more writing, um, more journaling, um, or I can put a piece of, uh, paper here, like, like, a from the collection, I can put a piece of paper and be able to put a picture there and then do the journaling here. Um, and then this, I'm not going to touch this page. I love this, how she took the negative of the sticker um, and she cut it around, she cut around it and put it on here and then she drew on the inside October. I love it. Um, and again here if I want, I can put a picture here. Um, little fabric tab she stitched on. Again, picture 31st or I can, uh, I'll probably journal and put the pictures here in this little pocket here. Um, and then this is a really old, um, I was actually reading it. Um, and see her little layering there. Um, book, it says keep your ears closed. And it's about like different ways to keep evil away. Like ghosts and things. It's really cool. So um, obviously I'm going to leave that and not do anything to that. And she, I think she stamped this broom. It looks like she stamped this broom. Um, and then in here she has this cute little fabric and paper layered with the house. Love the houses. Um, cute little mummy. Um, which I can, um, do some writing on or just leave them in there for fun. You know, some of these pages I'm just going to leave just for fun. And then here there's a tuck spot. Um, I can put a picture here or I can put a picture on the back or I can write here and, you know, same thing, vice versa. And it says eek. And then here I can do some writing, um, or picture, whatever. And she has a little, another little fabric tab here and then she has this little handmade embellishment that's a um what is this a stamp a post-it stamp and this is boo to you on this cute little paper clip here with the um with a spider charm but I'll, I'm probably going to just leave that there and then put a picture or write here and then same thing here picture or write and then she has a little you know tag layered with you know the different scraps and then book paper, little tab here. Lots of fun. Here's the other side of that with some more washi. Put the stickers and again picture. And then she has um, all her scraps. She took an old memory, a roll, an old roll, ro old dyed Rolex, which I can definitely um, put a picture back here and um, or put a picture on the back of this and do writing or whatever I want. Um, and it says Happy Halloween, which is super fun. I like things that I can pull out, even if it doesn't have anything on it, just to reveal the picture or whatever behind it. And it's on here with a little mustache clip, which I think is so freaking cute. But she used all her scraps. I love it. And then again, the candy corn with the lace at the top. Picture or journaling. And then here's the rest of the, the back, other end of the guest check. Um, it's just one signature, this book. Um... It says stay creepy and then she included some of the um, piece of the ephemera that I can leave in there and journal on or um, whatever and then some extra little tags she had cut out and then again I can journal and little tombstone and again I can put a picture journal whatever she stamps I put a spell on you another little fabric tab 
And there's the back of that. And here's the other doily. It says booty you with the owl. Uh, again, I can put a picture here. And then if I want, um, no, I'm not going to do anything here. But this is um, the other half of the glassine bag. And this is Eek with the black hat, October 31st. I can do some writing here if I want to. But I kind of don't want to write over the cat's face. So, um, And then there's this cute tag she created. And it's... um. I'm trying to show that the spider web's glittery so I can journal or put a picture on the back of that. And come on, cooperate with me. Cooperate! Um, and then on the back here, which I love, there's like this little like slip up. I can put some journaling or like a picture here if I want to, but I might just leave it. But super cute, look how fun! And then here's the other pocket here. She has washi and paper scraps, little Franken. Oops little Frankenstein. Um, she has some pumpkin stamps up here and then she has this cute tag. I put a picture here. Um, put a picture here or I'll probably, I don't like covering the paper so I might not put a picture. I might actually write here or I might just leave it and then I put the picture or the journaling here. So and this is trick or treat yourself with the crepe paper and stuff. So really love it and I'll probably put a tie closure on this you know because once I add pictures and stuff it's gonna pop open or I might you know to display it I might leave it I might display it like that so like open like that once I put pictures and stuff in it so awesome so I got that from her and then let me show you um, the rest hopefully I can fit it in one video but here's her other goodies look how sweet so um, she sent me some extras and she said she had some other things for me. She was sweet. She said she still has stuff for me that she's been collecting for a while. Um, me and her have talked on and off about sending each other things. And then we, like, we get busy and then we forget to... But um, she made a memory decks card as an extra. And look how cute she packaged this. This is Boil and Bubble because look, there's a little cauldron. And it says, "'Tis now the very witching time." Of night and there's a little vintage witch and it's 31st and it's super cute I love how everything like coordinates and then look at this this is a fabric piece and it says the block hat and it's a little banner and she made it so it can hang up so this is not going to be an embellishment on anything this is going to go on one of my Halloween trees so it's going to be an ornament Marissa um, and look at the cute topper I love this. I love black hats. I have two black hats. Um, and I need to find some of these. I need to find some orange tags. I need to find some, not tags, tickets. Um, but I love how fun her packaging is. And this is going to be an ornament on my tree. My Halloween tree. And then look how cute this little skeleton pick is. She added this cute little top hat. Look how cute. And some netting. And this bow and the flower. Just so freaking cute. So that will go in one of my pen cups, um, or one of my cups in my room. I keep Halloween out. My bedroom's Halloween and horror and Nightmare for Christmas. So all my, like, Halloween goodies most of you guys send me stays up all year round. Um, I have to put, I'm trying to, like, I have so much stuff, like, so much Halloween stuff that i putting up shelving in every little corner at the top, like, all around the top of my room. So I can, there's stuff all over my floor so I can hang stuff up. So I can put stuff up on shelves so I can display things. Um, because I have so much. So, um, and hopefully one day I'll do a bedroom tour once it's clean. It's horrific right now. Uh, literally looks like a 10 year old's bedroom. Like, clothes, it's bad. It's pretty bad. Um, this was her card to me, her note. But look at this. I love this embossing folder. And look how cute this is. And I'm probably going to have to have two videos, but she made these little cards, look. And I can write on the back of them to like use these as little like, so here, see how she has this card she wrote to me on the back of this. So these are really cute because I can use them to write on and attach to my projects. Um, uh, because they have the journaling on the back which is super cute and I love look at this tag I don't know if this is like a napkin or a treat bag that she used but look how fun that image is and then there's these two pockets she made and they have the gold 
I don't know if it's picking up, but you can kind of see it. The gold shimmer. I hope you can see it. It's so pretty. Um, and this one has the pumpkin. It says Hocus Pocus and the flowers. And then there's a little, you know, thing. Um, so, um... I'm also working on another junk journal, so some of these I might put in my junk journal or some of these I might use in my October daily memory decks thing. So like I might punch a hole down here and put this in my, so I'm able to put my pictures. Because that's how I'm going to, you know, I'm going to add things in between my memory decks cards um, to add um, pictures and things. Um, and then there's this one, again, with the gold. And I love the skeletons. And look at this. I love skeletons. Look at cute. It says eek, and this has a cute paper clip on this one. It says boo, and then again it has the trick or treat in here, so I can add picture and journal um, or do whatever. Um, so super cute. So I love those. Thank you so much. I love these like journaling cards. They'll be great for swaps and things. And this bag is super cute. And um, this is her um, entry. So hopefully my camera's going to shut off on me, so I'll come back part two for this.